The man accused of murdering a Daytona Beach couple is in the Volusia County Jail tonight and will not be getting out anytime soon. Gene McKean faced a judge today, and despite his confession, a lot remains unanswered. News 6's Molly Reed is outside the Volusia County Jail with more. Well, Gene McKean is back here in Volusia County, appearing in front of a judge here just a few hours ago. Now he's facing two first degree murder charges, accused of killing Brenda and Terry Altman, who were found dead on March 6th. Now in the Volusia County Jail. Please tell me your name. Gene McKean. The 32 year old was transferred back to Volusia just yesterday from Orlando. You have been charged with first degree murder and first degree murder. Investigators say McKean randomly attacked the Altmans on Wild Olive Avenue while they were riding their bicycles home from Bike Week festivities on March 6. They say he stabbed them and slashed their throats. Police found surveillance video of McKean walking around Seabreeze Avenue and then wild all of that night. Investigators spent four days working to track him down, receiving over 100 tips, one of which was from a restaurant employee who noticed McKean had signed his name for a bill. Police also used credit card data to track him and eventually found him at an apartment in Orlando. I'm finding probable cause based on the warrant. I'm setting bond at none and appointing the public defender. Now, according to the jail's website, McKean is also facing a charge as an illegal immigrant. Now we're told that that charge is through U.S. Immigrations and Customs Enforcement, so it was not part of his charges that were read here today. In Daytona Beach, Volusia County, I'm Molly Reed getting results, News 6.